gasoline. I have a decent sized metal pot and I'm gonna start. But the long fuse on this, it, it will then drop. Huh. Wow. The gas and nothing lit on fire. I thought the fuse would certainly keep burning and would probably ignite with some of the firecrackers submerged in the gasoline. Then I'm in gasoline everywhere. It didn't light the gas on fire. I'll light the fuse, let it drop in, and see what happens. I'm not sure what the effect is going to be. It loses the oxygen that it needs to burn. So all five are somewhat submerged in. Here it goes. Hmm. Seven. Ah. Hey guys, I'm Nate. Welcome back once again to the dome. And as I hope you know, when we're at the dome, that's always a fun time too. Of course, for safety reasons, I can't recommend you. That's what I was hoping for. So it was already on. Tape, an unexploded firecracker in and that wouldn't light either. It seems that the fuses on these firecrackers light the surface of the gas. That didn't happen, so now, just as a test, I'm... Fuse is lit. But it's possible that gasoline will... Guess if there's too much gas... I'll see you there. Fire and see if we can get any sort of larger result with that. Here we go. So I'm going to try doing it one more time and just see if I can do it. Gasoline. Now, I'm not gonna be quite. We do crazy fun stuff. Today our experiment is to find out what I, I think off, it might splash the gasoline so much that it soaks the. Hey guys, I am on Twitter at. Tw it's very dangerous. Lots of things can. <laughs> <laughs> ah, it worked. Range, and as added protection, I've also put in some earplugs because it echoes a lot in here. Stop the short fire in kind of a fireball, and that was a lot of fun. Well, we want to try and scale, put it out. Cured to the same piece of tape that the rest of them were, they all tore away from larger explosives. That might be something we uses kind of have a lot of push to them and that sort of made it spin around, but it still dropped fairly straight into the pot with the gasoline attached to the side so that most of the firecracker <laughs> now what I expect is submerged in the gasoline, but the fuse is above it and staying firecrackers in the gasoline. I think when the click the link in the description to come follow me on Twitter fuse and just attaching attach a little bit of a slower burning fuse to the quick fuse of the firecracker. Works if the firecracker isn't entirely all bundled around the same slow fuse. I'll try taping this on so that there only part stops working. Let's say that's the one that exploded. Ah. Oh. First firecracker went off since it was a remember to come gear your little burning bit that I think was the remnants but I think at least two of them went off, maybe all three, which would be pretty sweet. I now have five fire to try in the future. Thanks for joining us for this experiment today. Pop, still burning, into our gas. More time getting five firecrackers, but each one will have its own short, very quick burning fuse on them. So to make this work, I'm first going to... Let the firecracker, go, go, go. Self up with products and merch at thekingofrandom.com. See you there. Cracker did not into them that they could keep burning even if they are underwater, but it doesn't seem to work too well with gas faster. Try and do this quickly. Top of them, it gets down inside and the wicks get hit, and it just sorta, of, I think when the first one goes up, happens if you drop a lit firecracker into gas. Well, there you have it, an experiment to see. Crackers attached to this piece up, that was awesome. I'm going to add a little bit more gasoline, and then I'm going to try and make it so firecracker, and then explode while it was on the firecracker while it was exploding. It would be fun to try this experiment, slightly scaled up with some. It just sent flame. The other ones, and it gets on the. Top. Just putting a little. 
Maybe then if the fire explodes, it'll just spread lit piece of tape. So same idea, I'll lower it down really well. I didn't really try to stay a good distance away. Actually submerged in the gasoline, light it on three firecrackers, which are all... There's like not much left in there. There was a... There is a risk that the flaming gasoline could splash onto us, even though we just, as well as responding to some of your comments and questions while under the gasoline, launching a giant fireball into the air. First, let's just test if lighting several firecrackers go off. Not all of the gasoline burned up. Fuse is lit. Fire and the gas actually really think about how these slower burning fuse run away and then have it drop when I am at a safe distance. Firecrackers have a very I kind of thought these fuses had enough oxygen embedded in a little more right over it and it can't fly sideways quite as easily. Try it again. Gasoline everywhere, which is kind of what we're going for. Here goes. Cracker and drop it into a pot of gasoline at my feet. I'm gonna set up a system so that I can light it in the edge of the pot and got submerged in the gasoline. And I think we've seen that it only We tried to set up where a lit firecracker would fall down into a pool of gasoline and it was sort of soaked up. Of course, we had a little bit of fun just by splashing some gasoline around. We'll then tie the slow burning fuse onto a piece of string that's hanging from a stick. Not even all of the lighting, but we'll have to find out. Oh, well, that's not how I thought that would go. Over our pot. Hopefully when it gets down to where the string is tied on. Quite so dumb as to just hold a firecracker. There it goes. I was a little bit surprised when our firecracker and fuse dropped into the- Woo! Hmm, several more unexploded. This is a good idea. Just went out. I think it was sitting in the gasoline. Multiple of them definitely went off. That sounded like a much louder bang. That actually was soaked in the gas. So I'm gonna try one more piece of tape holding it onto the side. Light. I'm going to try lighting a piece of fuse and throwing it right into our pot of gasoline. Once again to the, wow, it's extra equity right here. The firecracker will light the surface of the gasoline as it falls in and then it will still, so I'm thinking we might get like one explosion after another of the gasoline. Dry. Let's try this out. I kind of have a suspicion I'm just gonna light the gasoline on fire. So long as we set up the cameras that it just. What happens if we throw a firecracker into some gasoline. Twitter.com slash the king of random. Posting updates, behind the scenes, get it down. It's still lit off, everything seemed good. I think at this point, we need to try adding gasoline to the wall of our pot that had a little bit of gasoline in it. Aim for the fuses anymore. And hopefully we get five different expl- All right, continuing on the saga of good decisions. I think what I'll try now is putting our pot so that when it did explode, it landed on the ground and lit all of the ground around it on fire. Gasoline, explosions, that'd be neat and then book it to the doorway of the dome so I'm safely out of The fuse burnt, fire free. I don't know if the fireball seemed much bigger, but it was still pretty cool. One more thing I want to... Little bit, less than half an inch at the bottom of our pot. Couldn't light. We tried lighting the fuse and just tossing it. It's not exploding, barely. So I'm going to try and change the angle of the stick so it's a... ...it in and see if it happens to work like that. I'm not really hopeful, but it's worth a try. And from the fuse swirling around, made it. I don't have a good way to put that out. Another firecracker into the gasoline, tape it onto the side of the pot, and then I'll just light the gasoline on fire. I'm not gonna try and miss our pot, just. Fire, which I think worked to our advantage when it exploded. One of the firecrackers just went off. Did not see that guy went out. All right, one more thing I want to try. I have three. Yeah! <laughs> Woo! Well, all of the motions. 
and the fuse will make our firecracker drop down before it explodes. I'm going to light the top of the fuse. Once it's getting pretty close to the quick fuse, just toss try as sort of a finale. Once again, the fuse pretty good results by taking a firecracker with a longer flight on fire. Even here in this concrete debate today, I'm gonna see if I can just light the gasoline on firecrackers, just go out when they have too much gasoline on them. We did get gasoline down below. The idea is that fuse burned on that one. You try this because that stopped the big fuse. It didn't burn through the string holding it up, it just came untied. Now I'm just gonna light this on fire and see what happens. Hi! <laughs> Hi! One more time, yay! Oh, let it go, yay! Oh, huh?